today I'm going to introduce、uh, introduce you a great Raspberry Pi set top box kit,、uh, which contains a PCB circuit board, a set of acrylic shell, and、uh, a blue light、uh, brushless fan. So、uh, it's not only can protect your Raspberry Pi, but also the Raspberry Pi's. HDMI interfaces and、uh, audio interface and power supply interface can be all be、uh, directed to the same direction as the Raspberry Pi network card is. So、uh, and the and a full size standard HDMI interface is provided. So that the standard HDMI cable in your home does not need to be replaced.、Uh, it can also be used on the Raspberry Pi 4B. Okay, and as a very beginning, we have to、uh, peel off the、uh, protective film from the acrylic case. You can see that. I have already、uh, peeled off the, all of the uh, protect, uh, protection film. Okay, and second one is to plug your、uh, extension board to your Raspberry Pi like this. All right.、Uh, once you plug the extension board, you will find that the Raspberry Pi is、uh, lower than the、uh, extension board, so we need to use different、uh, cobalt sticks to fix、uh, this PCB board to your acrylic case. Okay, and then find out this piece. You will say you will find there is six. Holes for、uh, for for your PCB board, and、uh, you may need the、uh, longer stick. You will find that there is four. There are four、uh, shorter copper sticks and the two longer copper stick. For your、uh, extension board, so we may need to put these four here, like this, and this two long copper stick like this. All right, and take your Raspberry Pi, put it on. Okay, and then you will find there are two、uh, shorter copper stick like this, and two of them is a bit longer than the short one, like this. You put the short one. To the extension board, short one. Can see that short one? Okay. Short one is fix the extension board. And the longer one is fix the Raspberry Pi. Okay. And there are two nuts. Use a nuts fix the Raspberry Pi. Like this.
Okay. The last one. Tada! It's finished. Okay. And uh, next step is to fix uh, your PCB board to the acrylic board. Let's slide over and align to this mounting holes. And there are a lot of uh, M2.5 screws. Use these screws to fix this board, okay? Screwdriver. Okay. And the final step is to put everyone, everything together, okay? First, it's your uh, back panel. You can put it here, like this. All right. And the left, Make sure this uh, this hole is against to your GPIO pin like this. Be careful this uh, this hole. This mounting hole is fit for just a little bit. All right. Okay, make sure it's aligned. Perfect. Okay, next one is a uh, red PCB panel. Okay, use the same way. You can see that. It will be here, so the fan will be here, right? The last step is to fix the fan to the acrylic case and then put it together. Put them together.
okay. Connect to the GPL pin. And put it together. Okay, it's finished. There is a external USB port, okay? Let's uh, power it on and see what will happen. I got a screen with a with a standard uh, HDMI cable you can see that every port will be aligned in the back of the Raspberry Pi so you can just uh, connect standard HDMI cable alright and that's power line. It's HDMI 5 volts power cable to Raspberry Pi. Okay. You can see the It's very good for your uh setup. You can put it on your uh desktop or your television desk. TV says it's very cool. You can see the blue light, and you can also connect your USB uh, keyboard and mouse here, and uh, Ethernet cable will be connected to here. In the front. In the front, you can easily to remove the TF card. There is a slot here, and uh, there are uh, another extension USB port here. You can plug your USB stick, something like this. Okay. All right. Here is uh, the second one, HDMI cable. Uh, HDMI port and this is a, a audio port okay it's very clean and nice okay hope you like it thank you very much see you next